After waiting a few days to get an appointment, I finally saw my dentist yesterday and unfortunately she told me what I thought she was going to but hoped she wouldn't, which is that I have an abscess on a tooth, which has been really painful the last few days and it's bad, it's bad enough but it's the fourth one I've had in four years, which is not good. <laughs> uh, quite depressing actually and the options are to take the tooth out or to have a root canal and the previous three I had root canals on because I think I'm too young to lose my teeth and although it only gives them a lifespan of maybe 20 years it's better than not having the tooth so that's what I'm looking at again I think unfortunately and I'm on antibiotics and painkillers to try and kill the pain and explains why I've been feeling under the weather the last little while. I've been trying to ignore it, but I knew I knew something wasn't right, um, obviously because I have an infection. Um, so that's a bit of a blow, um, but I just try to be glad that I live in a country where these things can be dealt with and there are antibiotics and painkillers and I have problems with my teeth and always have had the teeth and the women in my family are not great to start with and from the age of 28 to mm, 34 I had chronic um, acid reflux uh, which was treated but still you still have acid coming up at night especially and that just eats away at your teeth. Um, and what I feel I need to say here for anybody who may come across this in case it helps them in some way I know there are medical reasons for acid reflux but there are also emotional reasons and for me it was because I was swallowing back things I needed to say and when I started speaking my truth then for the most part the reflux went it still reoccurs occasionally but um, that may be of interest to somebody out there um, anyway that being said, it's wrecked my teeth, <laughs> unfortunately for me. Uh, but we'll keep going and I have the car loaded up with things to go into storage. So I'm going off now to visit my friend who's very generously giving me a space in a shed that she has. It's not used for anything at the moment to store my things, um, which is a wonderful gift because it's safe, secure and it doesn't cost anything which um, I'm truly grateful for. That's, that's a, real, a real boon to have somebody like that in my life. And she's an amazing person. She's like a mother to me. She's as much of a mother as I have. And I shall always be glad that she came into my life and consider her a blessing. Um, she has done so much for me over the 20 years that I've known her and continues to do many things for me and yeah, she's a really beautiful person. <laughs>